to uh, quadrants. To lock the gate. Yeah. Do you, what's this small? Oh, you got the, the separate wicket gate over there. Th those are the, the two side gates, yeah. yeah. And pedestrian gates. That's all right, yeah. Mag locks on them as well. Yeah, that's it. They used to, as you can tell by the, uh, the grooves in the ground, they used to be manual, they used to be um, operated by levers, but it, the trouble with that is, if someone's halfway through it and you pull the lever, it bangs them in the chest. Yeah. So you can close out as well? Uh, well, this this one won't switch out. Crow, crow can he can feel switch it out. Because you've got the crossing. We, we can't close out because of the crossing. Yeah. So, yeah. So, at the end of the day, you're not manned at the end of the day, but you just never close out. No, when, when the line closes, we all close to one another, yeah. Got yeah, you, yeah. So, yeah. But some days, Croker Beefield doesn't operate at all, the train just goes through and drive off the line. Uh, lamp unit? Yeah. yeah. And uh, that's for the lamps on the distance down there and the 14. How far is she? 100. There's, there's a fixed distance. Oh, 500 yards. Way, way down there, yeah. Oh, good, yeah. That used to be number 15, but it's, uh, it's, fixed, ah, it's right. fixed now. Yeah, yeah, it makes sense. I mean, it's hell of a pull otherwise, isn't it? Still, they still use the camping coaches for camping. Oh yeah, in fact, they're, they're far too, you can hire them for a week. Well, it costs about 600 quid, but they're, they're both in use at the moment, so they're in. It's reasonably the, cheap. The, the new one is the, is the volunteers coach from London. Oh so, yeah. Know, quite a number of volunteers have come up from London, have a week here and do a, a duty every day. We stayed so in the Dawlish ones. Up. They were yeah. the, one of the best holidays the kids had. Yeah. yeah. Oh, some's after. <laughs> yeah, it's just comfy. Yeah, we're hoping it's going to be fixed, but... Uh...